Uh, but you know, he's also taken a lot of technology from from uh, people in Japan. He hasn't entirely made it up on his own. And this is this is the T Hawk that I think he's probably knows, most known for nowadays. He's yeah. he's really adopted Japanese take on this character with uh, you know a great set of option selects. Once he touches you with that jab, uh, you're gonna take damage. And there, what, what he's doing right there after that jump jab is inputting the command grab, but then letting go of a button rather than pressing the button. Right. And what that does is that. Uh, he'll get a throw if you are throwable, and if you're not throwable, he won't get a throw. That's that's he'll all there block. is to it. He'll block. That's he'll right. Make sure he ends that exactly down like that. back. Yep. <clears throat> and plus another thing too, you also saw Fuzzy on the character select screen. He was considering counter picking with Cammy. Okay, yeah. That he, well, that would have been smart. He was he was hovering on Cammy for a second while Damien was on T Hawk, and um. You know, I've fought Damien Seahawk with my Cammy. I think it's one of the worst matches for T-Hawk. It might be one of the worst matches in the game. Damien still gave me so many problems in that match. And here he goes. I, I think this is actually a pretty rough matchup for, for Ryu yeah. if, the, if the Hawk really knows what he's doing. And, and that's he, that's it. What Once you get in that corner, you know, Ryu does have some ways to escape. He can do Roundhouse Hurricane to get out of there. Uh, he can, if, if you know, he can hope that the T-Hawk screws up. Right. Uh, but if T-Hawk is getting his full option selects on, then the the Dragon Punch will beat the right. Roundhouse Hurricane anyway. So it's a, bad, it's a bad look, but this is, this is smart. And you can't uppercut that jump jab. It's a safe wow. jump timing. If you uppercut it, he will land and block in time. So why is this matchup so bad for T-Hawk, do you think? Low forward. That's it. Low forward. It's so hard for T-Hawk to deal with that one button. Oh, why would he do that? No, I don't know. And all you have to do is every time you do a low forward buffer and uppercut motion, if you see T-Hawk go in the air, just finish the uppercut. And if he doesn't go in the air, don't hit the button and just go back to low forward. You can see how much of a... Oh, That wow. was so smart. Oh, my wow. God. Let's go fuzzy. Get out of the corner with the drill to go under the jump. The reason that, uh, that you're talking about Dragon Punch... Uh, no, I really don't Ooh, like that. Oh, here we go. Okay, he okay. got out. Smart use of that super. Her, her Dragon Punch is not punishable uh, by T-Hawk on, yes. on block from almost any range. So. Yeah, and in fact, that's actually one of my strategies against T-Hawk when I use Cammy is I will just walk up and meaty uppercut to get free chip damage. Right. Really, not much T-Hawk can do to that. But the problem with this matchup is this: I feel like this counter pick is coming one match too late. If Damien happens to lose this, lose this, you oh. know he's going to Ryu right away. And. Uh, and for some reason, Fuzzy went for the hooligan grab. You can't get Damien with that kind of nonsense, yeah. especially if you're not setting it up. Oh, he's got to he's got to settle down. Yeah. He's got to settle down. He's, he gave that round up. He as had great positioning for himself, and he gave it up. As fast as the hooligan throw is in round this game, three. Damien is really well trained to catch that, and it's very easy to jab if you're just looking for it. I think I think a lot of those backfists are supposed to be hooligans, so I, I'm not sure why he keeps going with that. Oh, that's bad. Okay. So Fuzzy's got him in the corner here, but, you know, don't press yourself. Oh, he's still going I for know. it. I, I don't like this. It's oh. working, but I think it's so risky. And he jumps at him? Wow. Nah, I bet that was supposed to be Hooligan, too. Oh. <laughs> Fair enough. Again, that's a Tiger Knee motion as well, but it has to start from down back instead of just down. Ooh, Damien not going for the spinning pile driver there. And he's got the sweep. Here he goes. But he was a little too far. Fuzzy has got to take some caution here. He's getting Oh, nuts. no! I think, oh, wow. Yeah, and Cammy any, any chip will do it. Any chip will do it here. Yeah, Cammy has a hard time punishing that. And no, why? With the jump strong, Fuzzy playing that. He was way too aggressive in that match.